Welcome to Week of Devotion from Luke 137. It says, For nothing is impossible with God. Matthew 19, 26, perhaps the corollary of this says, What Jesus looked at him said, For morals it is impossible, but for God all things are possible. And I think that's important. We forget that all things are possible, that we can put our trust in God because all things are possible with God. And I thought uh, of the song from Joe Darian, The Impossible Dream from Manuel La Mancha. And it goes like this. To dream the impossible dream, to fight the unbeatable foe, to bear with unbearable sorrow, to run where the bear brave dare not go, to right the unrightable wrong, to love pure and chase from afar, to try when your arms are too weary to reach the unreachable star. This is my quest, to follow that star, no matter how hopeless, no matter how far, to fight for the right without question or pause, to be willing to march into hell for a heavenly cause, and know if I'll only be true this glorious quest that my heart will lie peaceful and calm when I'm laid to my rest. And the world would be better for this, that one man, scorned and covered with scars, still strove with his last ounce of courage to reach the unreachable star. So things that seem unreachable for us with the help of God, with trusting in God, are indeed reachable. It's interesting, I mean, Basically, it gets down to who do you trust with God, nothing is impossible. But yet we have people that daily are saying, oh, follow me and you'll have this or this will happen. We have people in movies that show, show certain situations like all of a sudden you need $500,000. You don't have two nickels to rub together and all of a sudden magically 500000 appears. But we know those movies, those aren't real. Those are written by people who manipulate the script to make that happen. But the reality is, with God, everything is possible. But what is really possible and what we have is God gives us eternal life. And that's nothing that people can do. It's only through God, through that one man who is scorched and covered with scars, the one man who died for us so we can have forgiveness through our sins, we have the possible. And that is Jesus Christ. For this, we thank you. We thank you. Amen.